Hello, hello, hello! Welcome back! I am Ali Attic. You are here with me in episode 25 of Requiem HQM. And today we are talking computers. That's right, I want to pick up where we left off last time and keep going with some more uh, AE2, Applied Energistics 2 um, quests, because I'm kind of sick of this stupid storage. It's not enough, it's, it's, it's annoying. So if we can get the computer up and running, we can do some really good storage stuff. Now, in between episodes, I, um, I chucked my seeds back in and they are taking forever. So, uh, just to remind you all, in case you've forgotten, what we're doing is we're taking these, these seeds, the fluic seed, nether quartz seed, and certus seed, and you have to drop them in water and eventually they grow into being pure, Certus, pure fluix, and pure nether quartz crystals. Uh, but they just take forever. So I was thinking about what we might be able to do. And I remember that you can set up crystal growth accelerators. And that will help um, help fasten along the process. But then if you go one step further and you make a crystal growth chamber, it's like a super awesome compact version of setting up all the crystal growth accelerators and that kind of stuff. And it's kind of a little bit more advanced. And I thought, well, let's just go straight to this then. Why bugger around with uh, the crystal growth accelerators when we can use them to make this. So I thought this is a good first step for today's episode. What do you reckon? Um, it's going to take a lot of resources. I started trying to get some together off screen and then I realized maybe I should do it with you watching. So what do we need? Basically, to make the crystal growth chamber, we're going to need six crystal growth accelerators. So let's do that first. To make a crystal growth accelerator, we need a fluix block, uh, some glass, any glass cables which we haven't made yet, and some quartz glass. Uh, let's get the quartz glass cooking up first. So that for, for that, we need certus quartz dust, nether quartz dust, um, is that it? Certus quartz or nether quartz dust with some glass. Um, I should have some certus quartz here and you'll see I made the fluix blocks off camera. Um, you make them with fluix crystals just in a two by two kind of shindig. Um, now, what am I doing? This to you, to you. Pretty sure we're going to need a ton of you but some stage. Oh, oh, but I'll show you something cool that I set up downstairs. Uh, because I knew that we needed a bunch of these fluix blocks and we needed a lot of, um, uh, these fluix crystals and we're going to need heaps of them as we go forward, right? I set up this thing. This is a charger and I'll show you how I made it. It's really easy. It's kind of one of the first things you need when you're making AE2 stuff because you need to be able to make charged certus quartzes with them. So it just takes a couple of fluix crystals and some iron and you have a charger. Now you can hand crank the charger to make energy or you can plug it into some power as I have done here. And then even better, you can pop a hopper on top and a hopper below and it kind of automates the system. So you just drop some, blah, 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 blah. what do you drop in? You drop a uh, recipe, recipe, recipe. You dropped, uh, you drop a certus quartz in the top, right? Certus quartz in the top, goes in there, charges up and out pops a charged certus quartz, right? And that's how I got um, a bunch of them just really quickly. And because we've got like super awesome power now, um, it just went choo, 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 and just like sucked through them super quick and it was awesome so that was me being awesome off camera um now what am i doing uh what was it called i just had it in a uh, 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 chamber chamber crystal growth chamber uh crystal growth accelerator so we need iron we need some glass cables that's the next thing so we need some more fluids crystals and we need some quartz fiber how do we make quartz fiber more quartz dust with more glass. Um, okay, well, let's grind up some more quartz. What do you reckon? Oh, no, not just, not the charged quartz. Let's grab maybe half of you and come over here. And you'll see I was doing a little bit of grinding off camera. So we'll just let you cook up now. How much do we need for the cables? Which we're going to need a ton of these cables, right? Because like the whole system. Come on, click. Nope, that's not what I meant to click. Uh, the whole system that we need to build is going to like be with these glass cables. Come on, dude. Quartz cleared. So we need three and some glass. Well, technically that's enough, at least for the time being. Two, three and some. Yeah, there we go. Well, 
three. It's not exactly a whole bunch, but that's all right. Maybe I'll cook up some sand as we're doing this as well. Oh, so many things to take care of. Know what I'm saying? Know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, you can go in there. Beautiful. Beautiful. Um, now, I'm going to need some more crystals. That's, that's what I need. I need you. I need you. 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 I need you. 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 And boom. We have glass clay balls. Um, okay, so I've got iron on me. What else do I need for these puppies? These puppies, do I have everything I need? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. So cool. Uh, now we need a chest and we need a hopper. So I need you. So I need um, two chests. One for the chest. Oops. And one for the hopper. Come on. Ooh, do, do. There we are, hopper, and we need another ME cable, and we used them all up already. That's all right. We should have everything we need. Oop, it'll be in here. Yells. Very good. Yells. You. Um, and what am I doing? What am I doing? Quartz fiber. That's what I need. You. Oh, let's just like, grab a whole bunch. Yeah, because we're going to need all of that eventually. Full show. Full show. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Grab you. 32. Oh, yeah. And then. Boom. Check that out. So, I should have a. Oh, that was a bit exciting. Just as I placed the crystal growth chamber, the whole game just crashed. Ha <laughs> um, ha. But I seem to be able to click into it now and it seems to be okay. It doesn't seem to be receiving any power though. What's with that? Um, no? Okay, we keep crashing. I don't know how to turn this around to get the power into it and I'm scared to pick it back up again because every time I place it, it has a little bit of a moment. So I thought I'd see the um, crescent hammer doesn't seem to be able to turn the machine around. So let's see whether, I don't actually know what this wrench does, but I was just looking to see if there's anything else I can use. Does this turn it around? No, no. Um, okay, let's pick it up and put it back down again on top of that thing. And I'm pro, what does that say? What did that say? Didn't that, that said something weird. What did that say? That was weird. Weird. All right, um, I'm going to put this down again. We're probably going to crash again, but hopefully it needs to get power from the bottom. Let's see. No. And. Okay, yes, we crashed again, that's fine, but I did a little bit of research off camera and uh, I know why it's not connecting to the thing. So this isn't exactly where I want it to go eventually, but I do not want to have to wait for my game to restart again. What we need to give it is applied energistics power, not just regular old power. So we need something called an energy acceptor. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is what we need. So um, I think we can make this quartz glass, that's what we had before, we should have some of that. Need more iron and some flux. Do I have all of that on me? I think I might have that all of me. I, yeah. Um, I was gonna make another one. Well, I know we're gonna need another one, but let's let's just go with this. So if I put you there, ah, look at that. It is filled with the power. We can see in the little tooltip above. Great, great. Oh, check that out. All right. Um, also, just FYI, off camera, in between episodes, I was trying to work out why this wasn't working, and honestly, I still can't work it out. Uh, this should be set from signal. I feel like that's right. This, I fiddled with the numbers. I said is emit signal when storage is less than 50% full. Stop when storage is greater than or equal to 85% full. Um, but this doesn't seem to be... Like that's not lit up, right? Because I, I wanted to, uh, you know, test it to see if, if this is not outputting a signal. Emit signal when storage is less than. Well, it's never been on though, I guess is what I'm saying. So even when everything was like drained, this has never been on. But this means that this is not outputting a signal, which means this shouldn't be on. This should be off, right? And it's still on. And I, I don't understand. Someone please tell me what I should be doing. So I'm just going to keep having to monitor it 
um, by I, which is annoying. Um, but anyway, we'll get there eventually. Okay, sorry, I'm rambling. So, I can now go and get the crystals from the little pool above, and we should be able to see these speed along. So these go, these have been here forever, right? And what do they got? They got six percent, six percent, and seven percent. So you know, pretty crap. Um, I can actually go down here, can't I? Yes. Uh, Spa, let's see how fast this is. Uh, you and you and you. Look at that. So much better. Woo woo. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. That is so much better. Okay. Cool. Well, that's a success, even though that was kept crashing our game. And I'm going to have to reposition this somewhere that makes a little bit more sense eventually because, you know, having one energy except feeding one thing. And it's not, it's, it's not efficient. I will admit it's not efficient, but that's okay. That's okay. We'll move on. So as they are, oh my goodness, that's already, already almost done. I can't speak today. Done and done. Oh yeah, yeah. That should be a quest. Let's go into Big Yellow Storage Company. God, that sound is creepy. What does that sound mean? Does it mean anything? Doesn't, I don't know. So manual submit, great. As a reward, we get all those seeds. Great. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to chuck them straight in. Oh, I almost thought we crashed again. I'm going to chuck them straight in there and let them cook up. Oh, yeah. Oh, that is so good. So good. Look at that. Check us out. Um, now, we needed that for this, if I remember correctly, because we needed to get these cooking up. We needed a diamond, we needed gold, we needed silicon, and we needed you, which is a pure Certus Quartz crystal, which is which led us on this whole merry journey. Let me see. I've got a diamond. I need some gold. Let's see what we have here. You are um, circuit. Circuit. That's what I want. I want printed calculation, printed engineering, and printed logic. You are calculation, which means I need the absurdus quartz. You are engineering, which is the diamond. Is that going to work? Yes. Cooking, 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 cooking. Love it. Boom. And there are ways to automate all of this, and we will do that eventually, but not right now. Um, you are logic, which is gold, which must mean that you are silicon, which is the silicon, believe it or not. Uh, you, you are done. Oh, goodness, look how fast that is. It's just delightful. Just del Oops, that's I'm one and one, one in you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, super awesome. I'm so excited by how fast our power is just because this is outputting so much power. It's like whizzing through all the machines and everything is super fast. It's wonderful. I just feel so on top of life. This is great. Um, okay, so we have Inscriber, we have our printed, blah, 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 and now we need to make processes are one of the most important parts of AE2. They require one redstone, one printed silicon, and one printed circuit to make a processor of the same type as the printed circuit. So we need a bunch of the silicon um, now, which means we're going to need more silicon now that I think of that. Alrighty, we are back. My computer crashed. I lost some footage. I went to dinner. I had a couple of wines and now I am back. Did you miss me? I know it's only been milliseconds for you, but it's been hours for me. Uh, what were we doing? I was getting some silicon. That's what I was doing. And my computer absolutely derped up upon trying to see said silicon and we had a bit of a malfunction. Um, more silicon is on the cards for things that we need in in our life so I believe I should be able to do this and you should give me silicon wonderful cool um, and then can I put I can't put more than one in here that's a problem my question to you is can we put a hopper on the top will it stack this is my question let's find out let's see whether we can do this Oop, that's what I want to do. And like this, and like this. Does that work? No, because you need it to come out. But it doesn't even work anyway. Hmm. Hmm. It's because it's not on the right side, I'm guessing. There's all sorts of ways that this puppy needs to be configured that I don't know too much about. Oh well, okay, for the time being, we can just pop you in. Fine. Fine, 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 fine. 
Fine. See if I care. I don't even care. Um, because what are we making? We're making the 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 the. the I've already forgotten what they're called. Uh, cat processors. That's right. Processors. Which <clears throat> it's one of those, one of those, and one of those in an inscriber. Now, what? all of these have the presses in them, don't they? So, potentially, we need another inscriber. If we want to have all of this automated eventually, we're going to need another inscriber. So, what do we need for that? Two more sticky pistons, flux crystal, and more iron. Well, we certainly have the iron. Look at all these wonderful, juicy resources we have there. Super good. Um, put you another one of you in. Um, we need sticky pistons. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Um, two of you. And was that it really? Yeah, I think that's it. You, you, another inscriber. Boom. Let's pop you down like that. Great. And you and you. <clears throat> so we have you go in, you go in, you go in, and you go in. And ha 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 ha. Beautiful. Lovely. Calculation processor. And you and you and you. Beautiful. Oh, you love it when stuff works and your computer stays on and doesn't completely derp things up. And you and you. So we're going to have to figure out a good way of getting all of these automated because no doubt we are absolutely going to need a huge amount of all of this stuff. And standing here and doing all of this one by one by one is going to be super pain in the ass. So we'll figure that out. Okay, cool. That's everything. That's done. Da -da 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 we'll sing our own song even if they're not going to sing for us. So, okay, cool. All of that. Good, 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 good. Now, what is next? Channels. ME controller. Okay, AE2 differs from AE1 in that cables cannot have an infinite amount of things connected to it. Channels take a while to master, but, they're, but are a must for using the mod unless they're disabled in the config. Anything which stores or accesses information on the network eats up a channel. So a drive, question mark, takes a channel. A terminal, takes a channel. So does the ME interface and any of the buses. Now, I'm assuming as we keep getting into this more and more and more, this is all going to make more sense, but there we go. Um, so the first thing was to make glass cable, which we did. Uh, and then the next, well, what did it say about the glass cable? The glass cable is the first tier and can have only eight channels. They're the, are the best for small systems. Now, we're only going to make a small system to begin with. Let's not get too ahead of ourselves. So once you've exceeded your eight channel limit, you must connect an ME controller. Each face of the ME controller adds eight or 32 channels, depending on the tier of cable. ME controllers can be connected to a multi-block. There is no specific shape it must be, but it can only be up to seven by seven by seven. Making a single cube would not be ideal as making less faces than if there are more holes on the multi-block. Look online and find optimal designs or make your own. Uh, you can only have one multi-block ME controller. Having two ME controllers not part of the same multi-block will cause both to turn off. Um, well, what do we need to make this? We need sky stone block. How do we make sky stone block? We need sky stone. Now, when I went and found the meteors that had all the, the things, yeah, we did, we did, we found some. Okay. Well, let's cook some of you up, shall we? Shall we? Um, and while we're, we're out, actually, I'll keep you. While we're at it, what else can we put away? We don't need you for the time being. Probably don't need you. Um, I'm really not actually sure what that wrench is for. We're going to have to upgrade our toolbox at some stage, aren't we? It's too much stuff. Uh, quartz fiber we don't need immediately. Um, okay. Okay, okie dokie. Uh, what can we, oh, whoops, I went to the wrong place. Wrong place, hoo hoo. Uh, you is what I wanted. And what is actually the name of the thing? It is ME controller. I've got a good memory, don't even worry about it. ME control, 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 ME controller. So we need an engineering processor, which we have. So I think we have everything we need for an ME controller. Do we? Bam, yes. Thank you very much. The next, <clears throat> while bearing some similarity to ME covered cable in appearance, they provide diagnostic function by visualizing the channel usage on the cables. The channels appear as lit colored lines that run along the black stripe of the cables, giving you an understanding of how your channels are being used on your network. 
first four channels show as lines matching the color of the cable. The next four show as white lines. ME Smart Cable. ME Smart Cable. Uh, where? Where? Does it matter? ME Smart Cable. Fluix Cable. Um, covered Cable. ME Smart. What am I supposed to make? ME Smart Cable Fluix. Smart Cable. Which is a water buck bucket and wait what? Fluix. Fluix. It's covered cable. Which is wool and glass cable. Okay. Am I being really stupid with this? You know, four. Like you. And then you and you. Covered cable. And then. <clears throat> A bucket of water? I don't understand what's going on right now. No, that's... Mm, no, okay. Redstone and glowstone. Uh, this is very odd. Redstone, glowstone. Go you and you and you. Fluix cable. Do we just need the one? Yeah. Let's just stick to the one for the time being. I'm not... I, I haven't set up a good system for these before. So, we're going to need to put down our controller. We know that. Now, for the time being, let's just make... A very simple system so the simple system is going to need power so we'll punch through down there because we're going to need to put some power down and we're going to need the controller um <clears throat> how are we going to do this though oh, i uh, left the power cables upstairs because i'm real smart that way real smart that way mm -hmm. um let's make some more of you then i suppose so that everything connects and we have a good power system going. Yeah, 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 yeah. Feeling me, feeling me. Mm-hmm. Uh, which is you. Oh, almost crashed. And you, like that. I think that should be enough. Uh, let's just, while we're here, pop another one of you in. Definitely have to figure out how to automate that. I'm going to keep saying, oh, I'm just throwing them away. Throwing them away. Uh, where is my hole in the ceiling? So if we go up the wall like that mm -hmm, mm -hmm. we can have you like that uh, and maybe I should make another energy acceptor that wasn't hard to make was it I knew I should have made two before oh well quartz glass iron blah 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 I've got quartz glass I've got iron and I've got the blah 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 well well then you like a so like us all. Um, now, what order do I want these things in? Um, you can come here. You. I think I'm going to have this. Oh, goodness. I'm just like throwing things all over the place. I think I'm going to have some really awkward cabling going on for a while, but we're just going to have to. Come here. Come. There we go. Got it. Uh, sorry, uh, <clears throat> I, I shrunk away from my microphone. Uh, I think we're just going to have some awkward things going on here. I think we're just going to have to accept that. And I'll eventually try and make it pretty, but for the time being, we're not going to worry about it too much. So the energy acceptor is going to go there. Uh, and that means, whoops, I'm going to do this. That means I can put the controller like a soul. Oh, it's so pretty. It lights up. And uh, now I'm stuck in the floor. That's okay. We'll get out of there like that. Like that. Um, like that. Cool. So we've got a pretty Emmy controller on the floor that we can't really see. But it's going to work for us. It's going to work. It's going to work. Bear with me. Uh, trust me. I think I'm probably end up going to arranging this all off camera. But hey, hey, you get to watch the genius at work as we do it. We do it together. Woo. Um, higher capacity cable. Let's ignore that just for the time being. Uh, cause I want to get this system actually up and working. So what is this? Powering your ME system. ME systems require power. The more complex the system, the more power per ticket requires. The vibration chamber uses solid fuel to make AE the power system that AE uses. Vibration chamber. Never heard of one of these. Vibration chamber. Energy acceptor. Furnace. Hmm. Let's ignore that just for the time being maybe 
What's this? Bigger chests. ME chests are not the best storage block in the AE2, but are the cheapest early game storage. The ME terminal gives you access to all items in the ME system. They must be placed on ME glass cables, however. It doesn't really matter where the terminal is, as long as the, there are glass cables connecting it to the main system. This is what I wanted. This is going to give us our basic systems. We need ME terminal. Okay. ME terminal. Terminal. Ooh, okay. Ooh, we're going to need a few things. What do we need? ME terminal needs a bright illuminated panel, which is an illuminated panel, which is quartz glass, glowstone, and iron. I don't have any more quartz glass, do I? I can make a little bit more. I should have a little bit on me. Quartz glass to make you. Mm, is that just enough? Maybe. Who knows? Let's see. Woo! It's all crazy in here. Uh, I'll grab some of you. So... You. Well, we have three illuminated panels. Brilliant. Okay. Um, it doesn't matter what kind of illuminated panel. We just need one of some kind for this one. So then we need a logic processor, which we have. We need a formation core and an annihilation core. A formation core is another logic processor. Fluix dust and quartz. Mm -hmm. And another one of the U, U, and U. Okay. So we need to chuck a couple of U in the pulverizer. Uh, let's go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Because we're going to need... Ooh, oh, 8, that's what I meant to do. We're going to need a few of you over time. We will grab you and chuck another one of you in. Then here. Go... Oh, I need more gold. That's what I need. Uh, so let's grab all of you. So we go... 1, 2, 3, 2... Come on. No? Redstone? No? Hello? Hello? Is this thing on? Hello? Hello? Is this... Oh, bleh, super derpy. Super derpy. What is this? Logic processor. Calculation. Engineering. Logic. Durr. you got to actually make the actual... Eh. That's fine. You guys didn't even barely notice, right? My massive, massive mistake. Beautiful. You've cooked up. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. You, chuck another one of you in, and then we go, then we go, you, and you, and you. That's better. Yeah. Okay, cool. Done. Um, ooh, ooh, we had stuff left over. I bet you that you noticed that back when I was doing stuff before, and I bet you you were yelling at the screen going, oh, yeah, it's right there, and I didn't notice. I'm sorry about that. Super sorry about that. Um, okay, formation core. You and you and you. Do we have that? Let's see. Formation core. Yeah. Wonderful. And, oops. And annihilation core. Beautiful. Super easy. And ME terminal. No? And what am I missing? Ah, I'm missing another gold. You. I knew I cooked it up for a reason. You and you and you. Lovely. You oh great great you lovely oh how does it feel now here's my question to you how about we make a crafting terminal hmm? how does that sound we have the calculation processor all we need is a crafting table oh you just wait if you don't already know what's coming next you just wait uh, actually, actually, before I do that, let's see if I can collect a quest. I think that's all it needs for that particular thing. So let's make it ME crafting terminal. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'll tell you why this is exciting. I'll tell you why this is exciting. Uh, right now. Right now. Right now. Not entirely certain I'm going to be able to show you exactly what's happening yet because we need to make the drive. But bear with me. You come up here. Got you. One more. Let's go one more. Let me pop you like this. And what's this? It's an electronic crafting grid. Oh, yeah. So this is where all of our stuff's going to end up sitting. And then we get some craft stuff in here. And you'll see in a minute why this is so super cool. So let's just put a couple of things away so we don't get too overwhelmed by all the things going on in our inventory. Um, you can go in there. Let's just stick with that for the time being because we're going to need a lot of this stuff. All right. Next in the quest is a 
Items and blocks in ME system are stored in ME storage cells. The 1K ME storage cell is the smallest, holding only uh, 1,024 bytes. For info on how bytes work, blah, 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 blah. So we need to make the 1K ME storage cell. Let's see what we need for that. 1K ME. No, not, not IK. 1K ME. That's a better. So we need more quartz glass. I don't... Oh, yeah, I've got enough. That's fine. I need some redstone, which I have. I need some iron, which I have. I need a 1K ME storage component. Did I click on the right thing? One... No, I didn't. So another gold thing. More redstone and more... Certus quartz. So let's put you away because that's the special stuff and we'll grab you instead that's fine and we'll go and make another gold puppy a gold puppy mm -hmm. it's gonna keep making silicon every time I look at this because super useful great one two three like a soul great that makes you now do I have everything needed to make that Mm, oh, I need more redstone. Yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. Oh, you wouldn't even write about it, would you? Well, I don't need so much. Uh, come down. I don't know why I bothered coming back down here for this, but that's fine. You know, when you get something in your head, that's just where it's got to go. Uh, M, that's good. And then, boom, 1K ME storage cell. And we get an achievement. Great. So the next thing, the ME chest holds a single storage cell's worth of items in it. To put one in, right click on one of the sides and to access it, right click on the top. So the ME chest, which I don't think is what we're going to want to use for our main storage in the long run. But hey, that's fine. We'll give it a shot. A couple of glass cables. We need another terminal and some iron ingots. So what did we need for the terminal again? Uh, we need another gold processor. I think we should have everything else. You can cook up, cook up, cook up, cook up. Beautiful. And one, two, and three. Lovely. I told you we'd need lots of the silicon stuff. And great, great, done, beautiful. Bob's your uncle. Absa freaking tootly. Uh, I'm missing glass. That's what I'm missing. That is fine. We can, oops, wrong chest. We can deal with the glass situation or can we? Does look like we need some more glass. Fine, 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 fine. Um, how much more glass? We need just that much. Uh, just that much. We should be good. Now, yes, storage chest. Lovely. Boom. Great. Cool. But I'm actually going to ignore that for the time being. Who cares about chests? Because the next thing we're going to make is this puppy. Bigger chests. Drives. ME drives are kind of like ME chests, but can hold up to 10 storage cells, but you cannot access the contents using the drive. To access them, you need to make some kind of terminal, which we did. That's what this is. Terminal done. So ME drive, what do we need for that? ME drive. What's this? Blast resistant drive. And ME drive fixture. No idea. ME drive couple of diamonds. Um, okay. Do we have a couple of diamonds? We do. That's lucky. Okay. Cool. I think we can make this. How exciting. And then we're going to have a computer. Uh, which one's the diamond one? Not that one. Uh, is it that one? Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. Pop you away. Don't need you, I don't think. Uh, tidy inventory and tidy mind. You know how they say? That's that old, old fashioned saying back from, you know, the 1800s. Tidy inventory, tidy mind. And you, you, and you. No, 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 no. You, that's what I meant to do. Mm -hmm. Keep popping you in. Oh, yeah. This is so exciting. So exciting. I'm so excited. I don't know if you can tell that I'm so excited, but I'm so excited. Nice. Uh, oh, I shouldn't have put the iron away. Again, you probably noticed that, didn't you? And you're like, oh, yeah, what are you doing? That's all right. You... You, ME Drive! Yes! Yes! So what do we do? We got that. We got that. And we made the crafting table already. Terminal, I mean. And we get a 4K storage cell for that. Yes! So, I'll tell you what happens. We can pop this. Uh, I believe we can pop this anywhere. But, like, we can pop that there, I think, is what we can do. 
And then we take our 1K storage cell and we can put it in there like that and like that. And now, see, look there, we've got, like, you can see the drive sitting in the in the thing there. Pop up here. And we can put stuff away in. Let's pop it all away. All away. Put it all in our computer. And then if we want to make something, it'll look at everything that's in the computer and it will just craft it up for us. This is the beginning of a whole new world. A whole new world, people. I cannot stress to you enough how exciting this is. I Honestly, this is, I'm going to spend a lot of time. We're going to transfer everything over. I'm probably going to have to make more drives off screen or all that kind of stuff. We'll expand our storage, but we are going to get organized. This is totally my organized face. Are you excited? I'm excited. But with that, that is absolutely, most definitely the end of the episode. I have gone over time. I'm so sorry about that. Hopefully you enjoyed this slightly longer episode. Thank you so much for being here with me. I'm so excited with the, that we got our computer up and running. Like I said, in print episodes, I'm going to try and clean up all our inventory and I'll try and make enough drives and all of that kind of stuff that we have enough space. And you'll be back with me next time with a super clean work area and it's going to be awesome. Thanks so much for hanging out. Please like and uh, thumbs up this video and comment and share and all those good things and I'll see you next time.